Hello friends, hope you are doing well. Welcome to my YouTube channel Tech Weasel. Today we will discuss about how we are going to change how we manage the extended mode router. But before we continue, if you like my work, do subscribe my channel, press the like button and do share it with your friends. So without further delay, let us start our video. So in today uh, video we will learn about how to change the name of the extended router that is cascaded with the main router that has internet in it to make it more uh, fast and make it more visible and available for the long range scenario for this we have to go to the google chrome open the Google Chrome. In our case we have a tippling routers cascaded together to make it a range extender. So what let's see here we have a TP link 8 ETA router which is connected with our extended mode router. So the main router is this TP link 8 ETA which has internet in it and also it is same name of our extended router also so first we have to go to uh, the console mode of our main router that is 192.168.0.1 this is our main router which has internet in it Okay, so this is our main router having internet and this is the main status of our main router. Now go to our second router that is our extended router. The name of this router should be changed here and now we have to uh, access it through this uh, web console. So we have changed the IP to get it access 192.168.0.10. So this is the main page of our extended router. So username is like admin and also password is admin. Okay. So what we see here in this status menu or the page is that the operation mode of this specific router is in range extended mode it is uh, SSID is the same as that of our main AP so from here what we want to do is to change the name of our extended network for this first of all we have to go to this DSCP section and disable if enable then the disable this DSCP section and then go to our wireless network and from here we have the first option that is a connect to the network that is TP link ATD and uh, this is all the parameters of our main router Okay, now what we have to do here is to go to extended network and change things here. If you want to change our extended network name, then we have to change it from here. We like to write TP link. X tender. This is the new name of our extended network. Okay, and the password. If we want to change the password, we can change the password. In here, we let's say one, two, three, four, five. Okay, now save it to 
will take some time to save the parameters that we have changed and go to the system tools and reboot this router that is the extended router we we'll have to wait till our router reboots and power up again will take around 40 seconds or 50 seconds for the router to boot up again and make visible to FSID so here you see now we have two routers that one is the TP-Link 8ED which is a main router and the second one is this TP-Link extended network now click on this TP-Link extender it will ask for the username and password what we have changed is at min 1 2 3 4 5 click the next button it will stop and go to Wi-Fi the connections it will take some time to Wi-Fi and connect it till then we we'll have to wait now this TP-Link extender has connected but it's showing no antenna it will take some time firstly to connect and get the internet and after that it will it will make it more easier for the extended network to get the internet easily go to google.com now this rain extended network has started working its name is change also its SSID also change uh, it is not showing anything it is showing that no internet was secure but it contains the antenna sometimes there no you see it is connected and showing it's secure so this is how you can change the name of the extended network router easily and change the password also so I hope that you will understand all the process that I have shown here to change the TP link or if TP link is not available then you can use uh, other router that can be like Cisco, Linksys, Tanda whatever locally available in market so making it easier for change the password and the name of us of the extended network hope you like the video and enjoy the video and it's pretty easy to make and change your extended network settings thank you very much for time thank you very much press the like button share it with friends and do subscribe my channel thank you very much bye bye